Hi everyone, my name is Andre Anya, and yes, this is my new playground, a golf course. I wouldn't even say it's my new passion. I've got my two feet in a well-deserved retirement after enjoying a fantastic career in photography for over 50 years. Now the reason I'm doing this short video is to tell you that even if I'm not an active photographer any longer, my main occupation is sharing the knowledge that I've picked up all through these years and I've made it my priority. I feel it would be a shame if I, if I didn't spread it around. Okay, between you and I, have you ever asked yourself why you've chosen photography? How can you make a good living with photography? Is there a more direct way to fulfill your passion for creating images and sharing them with paying clients? Now, whatever your reasons are to choose photography as, as a full-time occupation or even a part-time job, you deserve to reach success. Listen, we all do. It is our responsibility to select the right way to get there. Now to reassure you, I'm not here to sell you anything at this point. Let's set aside any training program. You see, I know the industry has changed a lot over the last many years, and it's mostly into the technical side of it. Now, one thing that has not changed too much is, is how we basically do business. Now, this is my invitation to view a series of videos that I recorded live a few years ago in Florida in front of a group of professional photographers. Many of these photographers share their concern on how to run their photography business. You'll hear many of them share their challenges and how I responded to those challenges. And you know what? I'll tell you some real life stories in my own life and what each of these stories taught me as a lesson. Each video covers a different topic, different challenges, and we bring solutions. See, it makes no sense to see so many photographers struggle to earn a decent living. To see their clients tell them how much they're willing to pay for their services instead of respecting their prices. See, many photographers think there is no better way. Many will blame the economy. They'll blame the competition. They'll blame everything but their lack of knowledge and how they run this how to run a successful business. Actually, many photographers think that playing in the low market level at first will help them graduate to the higher end market. It rarely works this way. You see, Einstein once said, we cannot solve our problems at the same level of, of thinking that created them. Now, this means we all have to reach a higher level of knowledge to bring positive changes into the way, into the way we find clients into the way we create irresistible offers, into the way we make a price list that will pay for our new lifestyle while giving us a fantastic quality of life because you deserve it, you want it, and you deserve it. If not, we keep on living the same financial problems, we keep experiencing the same emotions of not being successful. We keep getting the same type of clients who will constantly challenge your business concept. Now, if you feel these issues are present in your life right now, they will always be there. Why? Because you may not know a different way to run your business. You see, it's your job to be the best at what you do. This is the only way to create that difference that clients will, will see and they will eventually respect. Now then, and only then, will you have access to the, to the wonderful things that photography can bring into your life. Now, my job is to bring you simple solutions. Can you imagine the feelings you'll experience when clients start referring your services to their friends, to their colleagues at work? You see, this is how I built my business. I didn't try to invent everything by myself. I did ask for help many times during my career, and I still do. You see, no one can do it alone. I've learned that the hard way, to be honest. I wish I had received this level of information before I started my studio. Because just like you, in the beginning, it was tough for me to find the money that I needed to have access to this type of knowledge. Now this is why I share this series of video. Let me remind you, they're totally free. It's totally free information. Let me make it perfectly clear. If at the end of these series of videos, you like the way I share my knowledge, if you like my stories, if you like to transform your present situation, if you like to learn more, then I'll show you various ways to get, to get there to reach your goals. But for now, 
why don't you enjoy the content of these videos and make a decision later. As for myself, after a very successful career, it, it's time for me to share, to give back, to play more golf. Now it seems that this message brought hope because you've taken some steps and the time to put into place strategies to improve your business returns. I congratulate you for this. And as you've seen, many videos, each of these videos are fairly short, so there's no need to spend hours and hours listening. Each teaches you a specific topic to help you move forward. So as, as I mentioned before, if you don't feel like hearing from us anymore after viewing these videos, all you got to do is unsubscribe. It's that simple. No money invested. It's just pure free knowledge. So I invite you to share this information with your photography colleagues who may feel the same challenges in their, in their life, in their business. I guarantee it will transform your life, it will transform our industry. It will bring back value into photography and to those who practice it for the right reasons. Now, this is my legacy. So let's get all together and take responsibility because all of this starts right now within us, within you. This is Andre. And I got to go. My tea off time is just about here. We'll see you later.